Can you not afford a hot tub to be able to do a hot tub Twitch stream? Well, lucky for you, in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make your very own hot tub stream looking like this. That's right. You two at home without a hot tub can be a hot tub streamer live on Twitch, even though the fads kind of faded. But today, I'm going to be teaching you exactly how to do this in three easy steps. If that sounds good to you, make sure to drop a like on the video to save money. Because we all like saving money, don't we? Step one, you're going to need a program, either Streamlabs OBS or regular OBS. If you have no idea how to use these then I don't know how you've been streaming on Twitch in the first place but I'll leave a video in the top right corner walking you through step by step exactly how to get it set up once you have OBS or Streamlabs OBS set up and ready to go then we can move on to step two and step two is finding a hot tub picture from the internet so let's go to Google and snag a picture so now that we're at our handy dandy Google let's go ahead and type in hot tub and then let's go to the images. Let's find a nice picture that we can rip off of. Uh, that one's kind of small. What well, looks like a nice empty hot tub. You can actually pick one with people in it so that way you're streaming with your friends if you don't have any friends, lucky for us. This hot tub looks pretty nice if I do say so myself. It might be a little bit small though because it looks a little squished. Let's find something a little bit better like uh, this hot tub. This hot tub looks nice. So let's go ahead and what we're gonna do is right click and then you're going to click copy image address. Okay, so now that we have that, we need to make it so that it's a PNG and we cut ourselves in the picture so that way we can actually see ourselves. So what we wanna do now is go back to Google, type in PIXLR or any photo editing program that you wanna use. And I'm gonna be using Pixlr because it's free. So I'm gonna go to Pixlr X. What I wanna do is click create new. And then now I wanna click on full HD because that's gonna match the stream settings that I have. And we'll just name it hot tub. So then let's create it. Now we have a nice transparent image because it's a PNG. So what I'll do is go to the side. I'll click on add image. I'll go URL and then paste the URL that we actually copied from the Google Pictures page. So let's load it. Let's add current. And then now we can stretch it out, which might cause a little bit of pixelization. Uh, so if you wanted to get a different picture so it's not pixelized or whatever, then you can go ahead and do so. But I don't think it looks too terrible. So I'm just going to stretch it out so the hot tub is like the center of the picture, like right about there. Now what you want to do is just carve a little space for yourself. So click on draw and then go ahead and click on the layer that we're talking about and then go to eraser and then now i'm going to change the size make it a little bigger i know that my camera when it's uh full screen then it's going to be right around here this is where i'm going to be so i'm just going to try and cut myself in so let me make this a little larger we will just go ahead and erase this give ourselves plenty of room while also leaving the hot tub there so now you can see it's checkerboard in the back, meaning that it'll be transparent so I can overlay it over myself, which is exactly what we're gonna wanna do. So now that we have this cut out, we can go ahead and click save. We'll do a hot tub transparent, and then make sure you save it as a PNG, otherwise it's not gonna work. So go ahead, click download. So now let's actually go to Streamlabs OBS and implement this with our webcam. By the way, if you don't have a webcam or you're looking to upgrade your webcam, I have a video that I'll leave in the top right corner that explains all of the best streaming webcams that you can buy in 2021, as well as all the best streaming gear I'll leave in the description down below. All right, so now that we've opened Streamlabs OBS, I have a brand new scene here. So first and foremost, let's go ahead and open our video capture device of our webcam. So let's add the source. Uh, you can add new source instead and then you would just call it webcam or whatever you want to call it add your source and then go ahead and click your device your webcam from the link here but let me go back don't delete yours because you probably don't already have one so let's go ahead add source i'm going to add the one that i already added so here we are this is me i'm full screen if you're not full screen then you can go double click and then change your resolution to whatever your webcam allows uh, 1080 is the one that i'm choosing because it's the full screen that's just my resolution but once your webcam is up like this you're going to want to go to add another source we'll go to image add source add a new source instead we're going to call this hot tub and then let's go add source and then browse wherever i saved it all right so it's actually right here so i'm going to double click on that now we have our hot tub right here click done as you can see we made it a little bit too small uh so you can either just go ahead and uh, move your webcam to fit like so or you can go back into pixlr and recarve out however you want to and make sure you have it too big or too small and you can just kind of change it from there but i'm just going to go ahead and move my webcam like so 
and now we are officially a Twitch hot tub streamer on an extreme budget because we don't have a green screen. We don't have extreme lighting to make that green screen look good. We just have a webcam and the internet. So hopefully you are now a certified hot tub Twitch streamer. If you need private one-on-one -on -one help, consider checking out the Patreon in the description down below. I also have a course holding your hand on how to start your Twitch channel and make sure you're doing everything right from the get-go. Otherwise, feel free to check out the rest of the videos on the channel. They're targeted to brand new streamers, probably just like yourself. So make sure to check out the rest of the videos on the channel. Otherwise, my name is Cody. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.